Hey guys, Murph1911 back at you with another review, and it's actually not going to be on the pistol that you're seeing in front of you, it's actually going to be about the tack light that's on it. It is the Insight M3 that I've just recently picked up, and I just think it's a really cool light and wanted to show it to you guys a little bit. Um, if anybody's wondering, it's attached to a Glock 17. I'm not going to be doing a review on it as of now. Uh, too many people out there have probably a way better review than I could give on it. You know, nothing fancy, scooch, people like that. So, you know, safety check the gun. No magazine, because it is attached to the gun right now. Um, a couple things about the light. It's under 4 ounces and it has 90 lumens of brightness which you can't really see right here. Turn off the light and let you see how bright that really is. Lights off. Yeah, lights up the whole kitchen. Yeah, just really cool. And if you would leave it on the continuous run, it could run for up to an hour on the battery life it has. It has these quick detach levers right here. And I'll just have to move the gun out of the way so I can take it off of there real quick. Sometimes it can be a pain in the butt, especially when you're new to it like me. And that's the light itself. Um, a couple of features, like I said, it has the quick detach for railed guns, and it has either a continuous or just the intermittent light by way of ambidextrous controls right here, so that's actually cool. Right or left-handed person can use it. Um, the battery it takes actually takes two of these, what are they, lithium CR17345 and uh, they're a little bit on the pricey side you know not gonna lie to you they're about what if you're into like a higher end digital camera which I'm not really but I know some people that are that's the type of batteries that those use uh, what I like about the light is how it quickly attaches to a gun with a rail at least a Glock style rail or any standard rail like that you could even put it on an AR-15 if you really wanted to, but I've got it for a pistol light. That was my main comparison with it. Um, that's about all I really have on it right now. I haven't really shot this gun with the light on it, so um, I've heard nothing but good things about it. But I can't tell you from my own personal experience. It, it feels pretty rugged and tough, but um, after I shoot the Glock a little bit, with that light on there I can tell you how it holds up as of right now first impressions of it I really like it and uh, I'm by no means an expert on lights I just kinda wanted one I do have to say I like that it's a little more streamlined than like the TLR series that Streamlight makes although I still am a big fan of those that's the other one I was considering I was just able to get this one at a better price point at the time so that's all I got for you right now. Till next time, Murph1911 signing off.